For the next 12 months, Credit Corporation PNG Limited will be sponsoring Project Walk, a program that facilitates the training of a limited number of students at a time by providing an overview of hints and tips on resume writing, job search strategies, preparation for interview and important social skills for making a good impression. CCPNG's Chief Executive Officer, Denny Robinson, says five schools in Central Province have been nominated for the program. In the next 12 months, about 450 students will go through this program. Credit Corp's delighted to be involved with Project UME in today's workshop, uh, Project WOC. Uh, for us, uh, it's about giving back to the local communities, being in, in the, the communities in which our people live uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. Obviously, youth unemployment is a big issue in PNG, and we think that programs like this will help young people to be able to get the jobs that they're looking for. Not only will participants of the program be provided with essential job-seeking strategies, but also budget and financial advice. I think that one of the issues and the challenges uh, in the PNG community is, is actually putting away some of the money for a rainy day. And so what we talk about is, is when they're starting work, to open up a, uh, an account to receive their salary, but also to open up other accounts with a, with a view of putting some savings away. So that, you know, if there are unexpected expenses and, and other things that they need to provide for in the future, that they're starting off their working career with a savings pattern and a savings program. CEO Robinson says the IEA College of TAFE at Ella Beach have made available two classrooms for the next 12 months for project work, including access to printers and computers. Whilst the Yarn Port Mosby Chamber of Commerce will provide support through mentorship by its members to participants of the program.